Let's see. Being here. On the country rose day, I'm over the moon. There's definitely a bond that me and Ellie have, and I'm pretty excited that I'll get a rose. Um, how was your day? Really good. Yeah? You had an yeah. amazing day? Yeah. It has been a lot of fun. Yeah. 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 Harry's a really easygoing guy, and I'm so happy that he's here with me on this country rose day. But I want to dig a little bit deeper and find out what he's about. Tell me a bit more about you and, you know, what makes you you. Oh, so I'm 35. But I've got a little boy, Xavier. I wish I had a photo to show you because he is, seriously, I'm biased, but he's like the cutest little thing you'd ever see. He's got glasses. Yeah, yeah. And he's so cute. I really love how happy Harry is when he speaks about his son. And I've got no issues with having a partner who has their own child. But I am only 25 years old and it does make me wonder a little bit about our 10 year age gap. There is a big gap. I didn't realise there was a big gap. There is an age difference, and I do have a little bit of baggage, which is the best baggage in the world, yeah. a little son. But I don't think that age should be a problem. It's not an age thing specifically that worries me. It's like, have you already done everything I want to do? I really want to be able to travel the world and be spontaneous with my partner, but I don't know whether Harry will want to do that, especially since he has a child. I definitely want to do more travel. I've only been to Europe once. Yeah. Been to uh, Mexico, Bali a few times. Yeah. Santorini, Mykonos, Berlin, Switzerland. Can you see yourself going overseas again? Um, not really. Yeah. Done all that. Um, obviously, it's time for me to sort of to do what I want to do. My dream, like I, like, I've always wanted to live on the East Coast. Mm -hmm. And like that's, I, feel, I don't Would that feel... be... Would you be able to do that with Xavier? It's hard. No, Because you can't, like, you can't. no. It, it's hard. I know I have to keep an open mind, but it's sort of sounding like Harry could be a little bit more settled than me. And it's making me question whether we're at the same stage in life. I really, really enjoy being in your company and you've got such a beautiful and nice vibe. Like, and that's, you know, that's one of the reasons why Becky and I decided to give you the country rose. Yeah. So I'm just not too sure whether we're going to line up. Like, I don't know whether you're a bit ahead of me. But I don't want you to feel like, yeah, I'm closed off to you because, you know, we don't even really know each other very, mm. very well yet. Yeah, so yeah. I don't want you to feel like that. Yeah, there is a few differences in our lives and there wasn't that amazing chemistry there, but I'm still hoping we can build on that. We are a little bit different, mm -hmm. um, but... You give us a chance, you have so much fun. Yeah. Well, YouTube, if you can't get enough Bachelor content, then you need to see more highlights. You'll find them right here. And you can also subscribe to this channel by clicking below.